Hey guys, what's up? It's E Man here, and today we are going to take on the Shake King. Uh, as I said in the last episode, this will only be our first battle with him. So, let's see. You stand before the Shake King. Tremble, tremble. Scary. Let's hop right in. <laughs> Yeah, let's go! There are so many Murfles. It's all, it's like, I believe it's like all the Murfles that we've found so far. And there he is. The Shake King. Oh boy. And here we go. Alright, so that's how we have to do. We have to jump on him and then we can do that to make him go like faster and stuff. Oh. at us. Really giant Goomba. Did I say Goomba? Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like playing Mario. Alright. Now he's gonna throw that thing at us. Now I believe we have to hop on twice and that failed. Here's the fun part. So, you may think that we've almost killed him, but, and there's the princess, and then guess what? He's gonna regenerate all his health. Like that, freaking cheap. And this is where the boss actually gets pretty challenging because of all this electrifying stuff. And we have to hit him three times now. Oh. There we go. And we have to avoid this thing now. It's been raining electric stuff. This is really annoying because these electric balls go everywhere and you have to avoid them and stuff. Whoa. And then there's just that one that remains. Super annoying. Oh, 
into electric thing. Now he's gonna shoot his electric balls again. Uh... He's almost dead. One more hit and he's one more time to throw him against the wall and but oh my god did I seriously do that again? Ah, uh, don't worry, we still have four hearts. We ain't on a time limit. So that's good. Now it's uh, boy, more electrical ball thingies. And you are dead. You are dead. I'm so glad that you have. You are dead now. And. Now prosperity is restored to all the Merkles and stuff. We've got business to take care of. Uh, yeah, let's. A deal's a deal. And yeah. And then, of course, the princess, and then he doesn't give a crap about the princess, and he just takes her and throws her aside, because that's funny, I guess. And then he takes the money, because he's greedy and stuff. That's also funny, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and now he happily shakes his bag, and I'm going to let you all enjoy the credits. Here they are. Those credits were short, and now Captain Sierra is an even greedier person and takes the money, and yeah. So in the end, Wario doesn't even win. And yeah, it turns out that Captain Sierra only helped for money, 
So apparently to all the to all the main characters in this game, the world revolves around money. Apparently. And it says thank you for playing. And now we've unlocked boss missions and we will be told when there is a secret map in a stage. So, if you thought we were done with this game, you're wrong. There's still more. We're gonna do all the secret map levels. And, yep. So, anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode where we will be, we are, where we will revisit Rattle Ruins. That'll be fun. Alright guys, peace.